Join CalTV as we interview Dr. Paulina Lishko, a winner of one of this year's Alfred P. Sloan Fellowship Awards for Scientific Excellence. Our focus is reproductive biology, and we want to understand uh, the molecular physiology of sperm cell and the egg, basically how fertilization takes place. Sperm cell could be a good model to understand molecular mechanism of steroid hormone signaling in these both systems, in neuroscience as well as in reproductive biology. We treat sperm cells almost like neuron with a tail. The sperm cells are attached to the glass cover slit and then we approach them with a pipette with a recording electrode inside this pipette and we form a very tight seal and then we have to break the membrane between the pipette and the cell and perfuse the cell entirely with our pipette solution. So those spiky dots are actually ions and in this particular case they are potassium ions. The plasma membrane has ion channels which we can open or close depending on different electrical voltage. Dr. Lishko is researching to develop more advanced tests for male fertility, fertilization methods, and unisex contraceptives. Basically, if you want to develop contraception, contraceptive tools, or if you want to help uh, people with infertility problem, you need to understand what exactly happens on molecular level, what makes sperm cell fertile, or what makes it infertile. In the lab, we're using different animal models, we're using human, rat, mouse, uh, primates, bovine, different animal model to understand how similar they are and how different uh, those germ cells are. I think one of my favorite quotes I recently came across is um, good things come to those who never give up. So I guess it would be true for any endeavor, whether it's science or anything else in life. Sometimes it's it looks like it's very hard to achieve and things are against you, but just with a little bit more try, with a little bit more push, everything is possible.